welcome back to my channel. I'm talking a little bit quietly this morning because it is currently quarter to eight in the morning um, and my parents are still in bed asleep because they're off work this week. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd just sat here to say hey everyone and that I'm going to vlog this week. So my weekly vlogs are starting from now. I hope you're as excited as I am about it. Um, I've actually been vlogging for weeks and haven't uploaded anything so I really need to work on the vlogging confidence so there's probably going to be a few montages in here because I realise I'm struggling to vlog when I'm out in public but then at least if I montage things you'll still see what I'm doing and stuff like that. I've got really itchy eyes. I've got like sleep in my eye it's really doing my hair. But yeah I'm actually getting ready for college right now. It's the final week of college. Um, which is obviously, thank the Lord, <laughs> but it could be a bit of an emotional one too. Yeah, a bit of a busy week this week, and I just thought I'm gonna start the vlogs now. I was meant to start the vlogs properly next week, which is the first week of summer, because I'm gonna do like summer episodes in the morning, like the summer diaries and stuff. So I was meant to start next week, but then I just thought, you know what? I'm gonna start today and vlog this week. I'm day in the life, not day in the life, a week of a college student, basically. Um, Show you everything we get up to. I was just going to do a separate vlog for the final day. I not good today. What the hell? Yeah, I was just going to do a separate vlog for the final day, and I thought that I never vlog enough when I'm in college. If I do a weekly vlog, I can incorporate it in, and we do have a lot of fun stuff this week as well. As well, we've got so today is a busy day. I've got a two-hour driving lesson this morning because my test is so soon, and I don't feel ready for it at all. Part of me thinks I'm going to need to push it back, like I don't feel like I'm ready. Um, so for that reason I'm doing a two hour today. And then I literally get back from my lesson and have to dart straight out the door. I need to make my lunch and dart straight out the door to the train station to get to college. It's going to be a very hectic morning. I've had to get up extra early because usually I don't have to get ready for college before my lesson. I usually have like an hour and a half for my lesson before I have to leave because we usually only do it an hour. I'm going to do two, it's taking into the time I get ready, so I need to get ready right now, so I'm ready. I was like up actually early today, I've actually been up since seven, um, but I've just been like getting ready and like making my bed and stuff, and waking up and all that jazz. But yeah, that's today, tomorrow and Wednesday I'm actually starting a new job which is exciting. I'm still working at Mackey's but this is just a thing that happens at, like every so often it's not like a full-time like a part-time job it's just something that pops up but it's just catering i'm catering at the cheshire show um in knutsford at Hall park so doing that this week that's for two days then i'm seeing charlie as well and then thursday's college friday's the last day of college and then we're actually that is the wrong one Thursday's the last day of college and no Thursday I'm in college Friday's the last day of college and then I'm out Friday night with my group from school there's two little lads eight teams Saturday I've got 50th and Sunday I'm out with Charlie so a bit of stuff to vlog this week but yeah I'm gonna end this part of the vlog because it's like five minutes long of me waffling but I just hey <laughs> So it's currently Tuesday morning right now. It's oh focus. Okay, right I don't know. It's currently Tuesday morning right now. It's seven twelve AM. Love that for me. I actually start a new job today, which is very exciting but very nerve wracking. I say new job, this is kind of like a one like every now and again thing. Um, do some catering for a business that my mum's friend has. Um, I'm excited. It's something different. It's not McDonald's, <laughs> and it's good money. So excited! So I'm working today. I leave the house this morning at eight, and I probably get back roughly about eight to nine, seven, eight to nine. Uh, working alone six, nine till six, roughly. And then they'll be like packing up and getting out and stuff. I just thought I could update you guys with what is going on today. Um, yeah. 
Well, straight ahead, bearing right, then first turning left at the pub. Country road, just stay on that and it brings you to the gate. You need to follow the road round and look for gate G, the main arena. And I am there, we'll be on site from 7am if you need me. Oh, good. You've got a map? It is main arena, so if you've yet lost, which you will, but if you get lost, just ask, ask somebody to direct you to the main arena or gate G. It wouldn't be an event if we didn't have a Mackey's breakfast, would it? It's an event. Well, work. So I've just got home, hence the outfit. I couldn't vlog when I was there and I just made that close morning. I think the last thing you saw was me eating a McDonald's breakfast. So I got McDonald's breakfast. It was absolutely grim. It was not nice at all. It was absolutely horrible. Got to work. We had, oh my God, the biggest. I was crying my eyes out. So... It took us to the wrong entrance and then basically like I was already late because it was taking us all in the houses and it's fine because my manager is my mum's friend so she wasn't like annoyed or anything and I wasn't necessarily late. I was late for setting up but not for serving or anything so I wasn't, wasn't too bad but I was getting all flustered and then I got to the right place and they wouldn't let me go through so I had to go all the way around and come in the main entrance of Tatton Hall but where I needed to be was the other end and I had no idea where I was. Everywhere was blocked off and there's like stalls everywhere so I couldn't get there like straight forward. And I asked like six different people and nobody would help me. They were like, oh, you don't know where you're meant to be. Like, I was telling them where I needed to be, like, give me directions. And nobody would help. Honestly, I was like, I literally sobbed. I was crying. Like, I was so stressed out. I was so nervous. I was just asking a load of people and like everyone. It was like people that worked there. It was people in high business and stuff and none of them. I was like, I'm literally working here. Like, I need to get to the gate, like, gate J. I need to be there. And it took me everywhere. And then I asked some, then some random guy. I don't even know who he was. He wasn't even working there. He was like, I think he was part of the show, like he was wearing like horse stuff, like horse riding stuff. And he came up to me and he was like, are you lost? And I was like, yeah, completely. He could tell I was so flustered. Um, And he walked me to like this information desk, which was like right on the other side. He walked me there and he's like, oh, ask him. I'm sure they'll tell you. And anyway, this lovely woman was like, go down there. Went down there, I got in there and they were like, oh, we don't know who you are. Like, I was like, is Linda there? Like, the person I was like, for because Linda there, this is a whole story time. They're like, oh, we don't know who Linda is. They were literally wearing it. So like, I, was, I, I just knew it was the right place. They're like, oh, we don't know who Linda is. So I was like, oh, there must be another catering part. Okay, I'll go out. Go out and then Linda, like, I'm literally cr trying not to cry. At this point, I'm like fighting back tears. And then when Linda comes out, she like shouts at me. And it's like, oh, I just burst out crying. And then it's like a mad hectic. But then after that, and once I got, it was like in the outfit and I like, met everyone, I was like completely fine. It was just because it was so stressful trying to find it. Um, like the whole job was fine. I absolutely loved it. In fact, like I'm actually, I actually really enjoyed it. And um, it was really, really good. Long day. It was nine till six, but I didn't really get there till like quarter ten. That literally took me forty five minutes to walk round Town Hall to find this place because nobody would help me. That is when I say no. I'm not like oh five minute walk. I didn't know where I was. Like it was like a long time. No idea. But it was like a nine till six. We got paid nine till six, and it's currently half seven, and I'm finally home. And I'm up again in the morning to go again. But it was really, really good. I'm very happy I've done it. I'll be doing it more often. Well, let's say often whenever she's got the jobs. Because she just does, like, say, check in, like, the races and stuff. Like, hey, Doc, and all that jazz. I'm about to get a shower and I'm about to go into bed and watch Love Island. And get ready for tomorrow because it's another busy day. So I want to get a good night's sleep. Tomorrow I'm doing 9 till 6 again. And then I'm actually seeing Charlie tomorrow night. So, yeah. Love that. See you Charlie tomorrow night. So it's a long, long day tomorrow. Then I'm in college on Thursday, but I do get a bit of a lion on Thursday, which I'm so looking forward to. I will say I'm lying, I get like a half nine. Half nine lion. This is like the most unflattering uniform. I'm literally wearing blue jeans in this. But yeah, I'm home now. Story time. <laughs> I am back from college and trying to work out how on earth you send this parcel back. And it's really winding me up. And I'm in a bit of a bad mood, guys. I won't lie to you. I'm just trying to work out. Basically, I ordered my... Oops, got my dress. I ordered my party dress from Dress New Day. I absolutely love their website. Literally nothing to say. But then... It's just this one item. I love it to be pieces, but sizing is completely off. And I can't wear it. And it's really made me sad. Um, But I'm trying to work out how to send it back. I don't know. I have to pay to send it back. That is so stupid. Mm. I was mm. vlogging. Oh, hi vlog. How no, are we? You're not in the camera shop. What? You're not in the shop. Mm -hmm. Hi vlog. How are we? 
I've just come from work and I'm very tired. Oh, it says on both sides. I was trying to cover it, but it says on both sides. Why did you just cover it? It's going on mine, so you should cover your. Dun dun dun! Oh, what? This is back. We're back to student finance. Um, I need to work this out now. Hello, Father. What the hell? Hello, Father. That's that was good. just very out of the blue for you to call me. Hello. I say this in every clip, but it wouldn't be my vlog if I wasn't sat at my desk for half of it. Like, I live at this place, getting ready all the time. Um, today's the last day of college, guys. It's 6.46am on Friday the 23rd of June, and I haven't been called this today. It feels a bit weird, like, I'm actually, like, excited to leave, but at the same time, I am a little bit emotional, because, like, end of an era and like my whole well not my whole group some of them staying but the majority of my friendship group are all going off to different universities now there's like three of us four of us that are staying um in like my particular group um so that's a little bit emotional and obviously my tutors i absolutely love my tutors we actually said goodbye to one of them last week because she's at glastonbury this week so We've got my other tutor who we haven't seen in a few months because, well, we've seen him this week, but we haven't seen him for a few months because he's actually on tour with a show at the minute. So it's like, it's just a whole bit everywhere. But I'm a little bit emotional to be leaving. It'll probably hit me when I'm actually, the last hour of college, it'll probably hit me because right now it just feels like I'm getting ready for a normal day because it is still a normal day, still doing the same things. But yeah, I'm going to take the long today. Actually, I'm going to try and vlog in college because. I'm sure Emma will have won a vlog. If you've watched my other vlogs, you'll know who Emma is because she's done a few, like, Emma can takeovers. And then just my... So, I'll try and get some footage in college today. And then after college, we'll all go in. All a few of us, I don't actually... We should all be going, but I don't think everyone's going to um, adjust the camera. I'm, like, looking everywhere, but camera's there, but I'm, like, here. Um, weather screens, some drinks, and then I've got to come home earlier because I'm actually out tonight for two of my friends' 18th birthdays. So I've literally got to go to screens, come back, get changed really quick, get makeup done, and go out again tonight. Um, so I don't know how much of that I'll vlog. I'm trying to vlog getting ready and stuff, but I won't vlog when I'm out tonight because it's not the group I'd vlog around. Um, but yeah. Parkway, please take a moment to ensure you have everything with you. And please also take care as you exit the train. Do also ensure you retain tickets and travel documents as these may be required for inspection of the station. Any customers in the very rear coach, coach G, please note that way due to a short platform. You will need to move forward to down inside the train. Any customers in the rear. Look at the train. Ah! She's here. This is Erin if you've not watched my channel. You do we watch actually did do a video once, didn't we? Yeah, so yeah. if you do watch my channel, you're an OG 2020 subscriber. Oh, 2021. Was that in 2020? It was 2021, wasn't it? Yeah. 2021 subscriber. That was... <laughs> took us so long, though. We were slapping all the time. We went out before and we were stupidly trying to film at like 9 o'clock at night. It was not going to happen. Honestly. Well, it was quite funny. It was good first. We're going to do more vlogs. Not vlogs, videos. Videos, yeah. That's on Erin on the train. Um, we'll spontaneously film videos of ourselves bumping into each other. We do this all the time. We don't like plan to get on the train and then we get on the same train and I'm like, oh hey girl, what are you doing here? Um, but I was actually shocked. And they scared the life out of me today. <laughs> yeah, this morning I'm just sat there and I'm like, hey. Oh yeah. I was going to say something then. Oh yeah, this makes a change of scenery because every clip in this vlog I've been sat at my desk. Really? <laughs> you have to film something college today. Yeah, I'm actually filming today. I've been yeah. trying to film all week but I've been here working so I can't film anything. Last day, last day vibes, got my cup of tea. I can't believe I'm this early and I'm not even in college. <laughs> yeah, that's why it surprised me because Erin's not even in college today. I and I was like, why are, you all, why are you at the train station at 20 past 7 in the morning? What are you doing with your life? But she's going out. She's going out partying. Not quite. Well, not this early. I am later actually. Uh, she is later. But I'm going out in Warrington though. It's just going to be, I've not done that yet. God, I feel like it's Hey guys, <laughs> um, this is Emma's ticket. Sorry, that was a bit close. 
So hey vlog. My name's Emma. I'm Harley's friend. Sorry, I just got American, don't I? I'm Harley's friend from college. Um, and this is our last day. <laughs> so much fun. Me and Harley, we've been friends since we were like 12 years old. No, I'm joking. We were friends in 2020. 2020? 2021. So cute. We're just so best friends. Um, so yeah, gonna miss Harley loads. But we're gonna stay in Oh, there are Harley's shoes. Oh, there's Harley. Like Besties. So nice. And girls. Oh, wait, and the mail. Hi, I'm Fran. Um, by Ella Bay. Um, he's at Ella Bay. I've known. I met Harley first. Actually, I didn't meet Harley first. Because I, I, mean, I did. Because I knew Emma and Bethan. But then I met Harley, so. Off to performers now, so peace out, Ella. Hey guys, it's Jess. If you don't know who I am, then you're not a true fan of Harley Faye. I don't know what's going on. But it's last day, come back next year, but. This is Holly. What's in Hi. <laughs> last day. <laughs> for you all i did actually vlog today i vlogged in college go me i tried to vlog on the train i'll insert the clips because it didn't happen but i want to see you notice how bad i am about vlogging on my own um let me move this i'm just gonna sit and do the makeup i've just had a mackie's had a shower chucked on my outfit for tonight i literally have i've got half an hour to be ready and i've got to comb my hair get do my makeup and do my nails so i need to be really quick hence why i'm filming at the same time it's getting ready so today i actually did vlog um college a little bit i can't put too much of this cream on oh it's actually, actually a boom boom cream and i think everyone does but they've actually put a stain out so it's boom boom cream i didn't even know that so yeah anyway today was the final day of college it was actually really emotional um probably tomorrow because obviously like i'm out tonight so i'll show you guys what joe got us it's actually really cute um Joe, my tutor, is actually in Paw Patrol live on tour at the minute, um, internationally, so he's doing like Abu Dhabi and India and like other places, so, but he came back for this week, um, because it was just kind of coincidence that he was not touring this week, which is our final week, so he's been teaching us, um, the past week, and we've had him since year one with our other tutor, Poppy. Who we said bye to last week because she's at Glastonbury this week. Um, my mum's just catching in the crack of it. Um, sorry about that. In fact, you see that. But anyway, he got us basically. Poppy got us our crystal brace uh, necklaces, and Joe had ordered uh, ordered us bracelets, but they didn't arrive. So we got backups. It's like like a backup present, but we all love it because it's so like sentimental. I'm not gonna look this one by the way, guys. I'm gonna blend it. It's more sentimental what he got us because. Obviously, we didn't pop like I just said, and we've been talking about it for so long now. Um, and he got us all, <laughs> it's really stupid, but it's actually quite good. The Paw Patrol chocolate eggs, like Kinder eggs, that have Paw Patrol toys in them. So I got a chase dog, and then it can go in my memory box, and it's just like a reminder of like LMA and Joe, and like that's how we finished it. It's actually really nice. Um, and then he got us all a card, and we all sobbed. And then we, our end of year musical was High School Musical, if you don't know so we had a well all day we did like some workshops and stuff and then this the, at the end of the day we had like half an hour and we did some reminiscing and we did we did matilda in first year so we did a little bit of our old matilda choreo and vocals 
to when I grow up and got a bit of motion and then we did the finale of High School Musical again which we performed on stage a few weeks ago um, and obviously that made us all cry because it was like oh my god this is the end and he made us do the final bow and he's like this is your final bow together and all the rest of it and then everyone was crying I'm actually going back to the same place in September but for the uni course and a few people are but like my friendship group I think I've actually already said this they're all going off to different unis so it was just emotional like as much as I'm going back to the same place it's different people it's different tutors it's different completely different it's a different ball game like I'm going on to do a BA honours degree and I've been doing a BSEC like it's completely different so it was just emotional to like say goodbye to those that are actually fully leaving um, I say goodbye to the class in general because even though some of us are staying there's four classes so we're not going to be together so it's a little bit emotional so that happened and then afterwards um, I just popped into Primark because I needed to get some false I'm not my phone I had to get some false nails for tonight and tomorrow that match both my outfits so I've just picked up plain white nails I don't know how I feel about it I've never been a white nails girl but it's gonna have to do because this dress this outfit even is very busy and I feel like there was no nails that were gonna match it can I turn your music down I'm gonna get copyrighted um that's funny they actually turned it off and they said that that's actually quite coincidental isn't it but yeah, I popped in and I tried to do a little haul on the, the train for you guys and it failed completely. But I just got nails and a pair of denim shorts. Uh, no, a pair of pyjama shorts, not denim shorts. Um, so there's not really much to show you in here. But I will just show you in a bit because why not? Um, but we did that and then came home. I've just home out the little tiny shower and now I'm getting ready to go out. And I've not got a lot of time at all. So getting ready as quick as we can. And I need an Instagram picture as well because this is a collaboration. Um outfit kind of want to get it before we get there because the lads it's like more it's it's my friendship group from school and it's mostly lads there's a few girls um i went to school with and then a few that are kind of like the group's kind of expanded as people went to college and met new people and then the group got bigger it, instead of it's weird because most most kind of scenarios the groups like split up don't they and meet new groups but our group just got bigger like people met people and then people just came into the group rather than splitting off which is not a bad thing um but that happened. That happened with our group. So, um, what was I saying? So I don't really want to take Instagram photos while I'm there because I feel like number one, it's my mate's birthdays, so I just feel a bit awkward. I just get taken the mick out of by the lads, so there's no point in that, really. So I try and get one while I'm at home. I might get one when I'm out. It depends what it's all like. It's at the wine bar in Stockton Heath. If anyone's ever been, um, I've been actually never been. I'm not even eighteen, so I'm not usually allowed in there. But because they've hired it. I'm allowed in. Um, so that's exciting that I get to go there. I'm not drinking for obvious reasons. Number one, I'm not 18, so I'm not going to buy anything. And number two, if you've watched me for a while, you know I'm not really the biggest drinker. Um, I did drink a few weeks ago at a party we went to, and just never again am I ever drinking. Um, I was even messaging my boyfriend's mum. It's just a bit embarrassing, isn't it? So never again am I doing that. She says until next time, but I'm actually just not a big drinker to be fair. This is turning into a bit ready with me. I need to shut up. I just wanted to update you guys where we're up to, up to in the day. Probably won't vlog much today. I might show you my outfit if I've got time. If not, I shall see you guys in the morning. Thought I'd just chat to you while I make my bed. It's currently, if I can start every clip with this, but Saturday the 24th of June, 5 to 12. And I literally only woke up like half an hour ago. So that's fun, but it's actually kind of a bad thing. Last night, I was like, I'm going to set an alarm. I'm going to let my body sleep because like, I've been so exhausted. But I completely forgot how much I had to do today. Um, I literally have three hours until Charlie's coming to pick me up. And um, because it's his mum's birthday party today. But I need to go. I've got her a present. Um, but I want to get like a little, few little bits from town. And also a card for her. Um. But I need to walk to town because my mum's not here, so I'm gonna have to literally get ready so quick now. Run to town, it's gonna take about 25 minutes to get to town. Go around town, go around and you come back. We're probably looking at like half on two, and I have an hour to actually get ready. And I need to wash my hair as well and dry it because I want it straight. And I killed it last night, so yeah. I'm gonna need to pack a bag, uh, pa uh, pack a bag because I am um, sleeping with Charlie's tonight, so. We're in a little bit of a slight rush today. Not in the major rush, but we're in a rush. I can't just dawdle, you know? These are what I got from um, Primark yesterday that I was saying. 
they're just blue stripey pajama shorts but they're like that material that keep you like cool in the summer and hot in the winter it's like a weird material i love them i've got them in pink as well um i used to have similar like last year and then i got these nails i don't think i just showed you i've never liked white nails but to be fair i'm actually feeling them but they're actually quite nice so i've got them as well they've stayed on really well considering the falsies but i got two packs of them because i didn't know if i was going to lose them last night i need a new pack for today um because the reason i actually got white was because I had a party last night and a party tonight and well today ish this afternoon and the outfits are both completely different i had like a pink swirly one on yesterday and then today i'm wearing like a green two-piece so completely different so i had to get nails that kind of match both in a way because if i could i didn't want to have to try and force nails off and put other ones on um so yeah, that is a slight plan of action today. I'll just take you along with me and what I do and yeah, you'll just see if you go on. It's currently Saturday, so you're doing well if you're still here on this vlog. It's been everywhere, like everywhere. Actually, this vlog has been all over the place, so don't you worry. I know it's been bad. I'm ready to go out. Oh, this top looks a little bit see-through at the top, but it isn't as see-through as it's on camera. Just wearing a cute little yellow dress from Primark. I actually sized down in this to so 2XS because I got a size small and it was huge. Extra small was too big. It was like dead like baggy because it's stretchy. So I sized to a two XS and it's kind of a bit long like that. I seem to do this stuff. I feel like it looks a little better. Yeah, cute. And a smart. Hey everyone, Charlie's here. I think you've already featured in this week's vlog when you came round. Okay. I don't even know what, we, what vlog I'm on. Anyway, it's actually Sunday. Sorry guys. <laughs> when was the last time you vlogged? Yesterday morning, saying how much I had to do. I didn't vlog at yours. I don't think I vlogged when I got ready either. I think I was, it was just before I got ready. But it's Sunday. It's the last day of the vlog. And we're at the Holly's Farm Shop right now. I probably... The big one. The big one in Tarpoli. I might film a little bit in here, it depends. It's nice, isn't it? I like it. Yeah, depends if I can get my camera out or not. But, or my phone out. <laughs> so yeah, this is, this is where we are. Charlie's very tired. <laughs> um, and I just thought I'd update you guys before you just see a random load of footage in somewhere after I've just been at home. It's not Saturday anymore, it's Sunday. We had a good night last night though, didn't we? Mm hmm, yeah, it was good fun. You just not want to be in the vlog right now. Yep, fine. Chill. Chill. Right. Yeah. Right. Two late nights catching yeah. up with us. Yeah. We're gonna go in the farm shop now and I'll take you guys <laughs> with me. Literally having the biggest night of our clothes on, by the way. We are having the biggest night of our lives. We're sat at the hall he's just trying to get food. And they give us, they mixed up like, they give you like a blooper. They give you like a blooper and it goes off in the food ready. But they got ours mixed up with someone else's, so we end up with someone else's food. And we know about our food is. And then they give him someone else, like they just said to him, well, this is yours. They give it us and it wasn't our food. So I came back from the third time, he's still waiting for our food. We literally ordered like 20 minutes ago, so I don't know what's going on. We literally ordered two rows um, and two baths as well. It's a bit of a nightmare, to be honest. Um, yeah, I did buy, I'll show you when I get in the car. Um, but I did buy some crystals. And Charlie got me a birthday present, but obviously I can't have that yet. But yeah, we're just having a little bit of a nightmare, really. We've um, got a coat, Charlie got a chocolate milkshake thing. It's demolish. Um, yeah. <laughs> so when you saw us before, we were like, looked good and it wasn't raining. Look at the weather now. What on earth just happened? A bit soggy, isn't it? It's really bad. Look, we just literally sprinted and were drenched. Like, you can see it in hair. It's like my shorts are dark green and they were light green. I'm going to do a little haul. Oh, actually, you might not be able to hear me over the blowers. Thanks. Uh, hold on. It's all right. It's fine. There you go. Oh. That's interesting. I'm tired. So I got some crystals, I got an amethyst bracelet because I don't have an amethyst yet, Charlie hates crystals, he doesn't hate them, he just doesn't get the point in. So amethyst helps willpower and negative thoughts, 
Then I got a citron keyring for my keys. Citrine's my favourite crystal. Um, citron and carnelian are my favourite, but I love this one and it's a really nice one. So yeah, picked up them. And Charlie bought me a birthday present. I did. That I've got to forget about apparently. Yeah, I'm going to try and forget about it. Yeah. Now we're just going to sit here until the rain is calming down now. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll head off now. Yeah. Because. Oh! Another one. Do you know it's the same one from this? Oh, Charlie. What now? The one that I just put in there is gone. So, you in the door? In, you, no, in your car somewhere. There's I've a white a nail. nail. <laughs> <laughs> my nails keep. Right, so that nail snapped off on Charlie's door. That nail snapped up on the toilet doors. Love that. Um, Charlie, could you get that off very carefully? Don't pull it because it'll snap. It'll snap the bracelet. It was expensive. Closing off the vlog here. It's actually it's Monday of the next week now. Um, I'm just editing this to get it up, but I just thought I'd come in here and close it off really quick. Sorry about shaky cameras, for some reason my hand is so shaky today, like my whole body's just like, oh, yeah, it's not good, so sorry about shaky camera. Um, if you don't, make sure you get a big thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, we're on the road to 1k, and the aim is to hit 1k by my birthday, which is August, so if you want to be involved in helping that out, then hit the subscribe button. Oh my god, right, no, we need to rest. There we go. Yeah, hit the subscribe button if you're new, if not, then thanks for subscribing already. Um, follow my social media, so I'll put it on screen, I'll put my Instagram on screen now for you to follow. And yeah, more weekly vlogs to come, I'm actually on summer now, so these will all be my summer diary vlogs now from next Monday onwards, every Monday upload. I upload Monday, Wednesday, Friday on my main channel and then like my shorts, the YouTube shorts, I'll, I'm actually filming a lot today to start posting them daily, so stick around, there's a lot of content coming for you guys. And yeah, see you guys very, very soon, bye!